Hello everyone! Welcome back to this game! When we last left off, I apparently grossly uh, overestimated how many rings I'd be collecting. Only 150? Really? Huh. Well, I at least was right about the objective that we would be performing right now. Whoa! Yep. Okay, that's a good start. Uh, let's try to scooch on back over here, please. Thank you very much. No, don't skip all of those. Oh, I, I hope I still have a chance at this. Was there another path I could have come from? You know what? My goal is just to get the rings. I don't necessarily have to collect them in the correct order, except for I was trying to avoid that. Oh, uh, well, there's probably enough coming up. I swear there's... Oh. Okay, I call shenanigans on the mid-air mechanics. No you can usually air dash. You just saw me air dashing. However, for some reason, whenever it comes to those rings that I need to dash through, it's not air dashing that you need to do, it's boosting. Shenanigans. And inconsistency. That is annoying. So what now? Time attack? Time attack. No problem. So out of curiosity, what's in this direction? Kind of the scenic route, I guess. And it just winds up coming back together. Ah, there was an outside path. Oh, there was a ramp up there, too. Oh, I've been on that ramp. Okay. You know what? You guys are only going to slow me down, so... Although you might have also allowed me a shortcut. Okay, this is um, going to take a couple of attempts. Ah, oh, I was so close to the checkpoint. Had I not failed that quick time event. This, this game is really teaching me why I should hate quick time events. I always hear people complaining about them, and it's like, well, they aren't so bad. So, quick time event comes up telling you to mash a button. Okay, I'll just go ahead and mash that real quick. But when it comes to specific button presses like that, where you have to be aware that there's a button press coming up first off, and also make sure you press the correct button or you fail, yeah, I can definitely see why people hate quick time events. Stop missing these, they are kind of necessary if I want to be quick about getting through. You, I will... Press that, press that. Okay, that ring I was able to do the dash attack, I didn't need to do boost. And I'm not sure what happened to this then. Well, now we get to try out a different part of the stage, so that's kind of neat. Uh, that was another quick time event, and I kind of failed because I was pressing B instead of A. Out of my way, please, thank you. Oh, I am screwed. Okay, whatever path that was that I took, I'm gonna go ahead and not take it again. Uh, I was not trying to do the light dash. What is the light dash even doing in, in this game? There aren't actually very many places that you can use it. Oh, there's a checkpoint right there? Well, heck, that's the path I need to be taking. Let's get you guys for a moment. 
there a checkpoint here as well? No, it doesn't seem to be. The checkpoint's actually right across here. Thankfully, that quick time event is always the B button. A checkpoint right there. And once again, these guys are being a nuisance. Now I'm getting somewhere. Oh, I'm getting to the end. That went much better. So why is it, by the way, that you collect moon medals during the day and sun medals during the night? That has been bugging me the whole game, and I don't get it. Because doing it the other way would have been too obvious? Are they trying to be contrarian? I'm collecting rings again. Really? Oh, Alright, at least it's a different part of the stage. Which part out of curiosity? Don't miss it. Good. No, but we can do it. Uh, that was a spot where I needed to do the light dash. I was just saying how there's not very many locations where you do a light dash. Okay, well, I wound up clipping into the rail. I'm okay with this. You know, the fact that we're basically replaying the same level with different challenges is kind of lame, but at the same time, I'm still enjoying myself doing that. I guess it helps that I'm familiar or more familiar with the level, so I'm a little more able to react to different things and thus play better. I don't know. I don't, I, I just don't find it as big a deal that we're just doing the same level over and over again for some reason. Sonic, let's, let's search Adabat for someone who can make a planet tablet. The most important person in the village must be the Temple Guardian, no? Well, let's go to the obvious location. I see you collected some tablet fragments. Going through the door? I don't suppose I can stop you. Okay, let me have the fragments. With a little finesse, you got yourself a planet tablet. Take it. You are on your way. Yep, we're on our way to the next boss. So we're getting ready to restore continent number six then. Ow! Professor Pickle says we're a long ways off from finishing the game, but it sure doesn't feel that way. At the rate we're going, I might be done with the game in the next stream. So I'm expecting a daylight boss this time, by the way. Yep. Who we got? A Glancer. It, it's so random. Like, I know we're going through a boss door, I should totally expect a boss fight. But the fact that it's just... Hey, here's Eggman. It feels really random and sudden. It's like... No build-up? I feel like these fights against Robotnik should be having some sort of build-up. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, wait, no, no, that was my chance. I thought it was kind of, I was so distracted by the funniness of him hurting himself like that. I figured, oh, it's probably, um, maybe I just have to wait for him to damage himself. No, that's not quite the case. I need to bash him after he gets bashed. Uh, I don't want to take it. I'm kind of... Okay, that sort of quick time event was not so bad. It seemed like it was giving me ample time to react to it. Lap 2! I need to remember that dodging is a thing. Oh, he was wide open. I could have totally tried boosting into him. I'm learning his patterns, though. Oh, wow. Okay. That's sort of tricky, but... Uh, I got this. And then you'll get hit by your own boulder, and I need to dash in there for some damage. Did I damage him? I wasn't able to tell. I don't like that very much, actually. I don't think I was able to damage you that time. You were wide open. There we go. That's what I was trying to do. And there we go. That wasn't too hard. I like that fight. That was a good fight. And I like the variety in that fight. There was a lot going on in that fight. What? Over already? Oh well. Yay! A nest rink. Ooh, cussing. another old temple. It doesn't look like there's anyone around, either. That's... that's not what I mean. That's not... never mind. I'm fine. Let's go. No, no, no. Tell us more. Sonic knows something's up. He's not taking that it's fine BS that people like to give. It's nothing. Oh, it's definitely something. Whoa. Nice that this uh, restoration scene is different from the others. Oh! 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 No! I welcome your return. What? Messenger of day, of light, of rebirth. I hope this is a good thing. Thank you. 
Oh, right. We were restoring the continent. Okay, continent restored. Back to the con uh, the cutscene. Oh, good. Gaia and I were awakened before we should have been. I'm glad that he's not like Dark Gaia, and we have to kill him or something. I didn't remember what I was supposed to do. All because this isn't the proper time of awakening. Time of awakening. Dark Gaia grows over millions of years, then rises to destroy the world. And I put it all back together. We've been doing this over and over, again and again, since the very beginning of time. So you were asleep all this time? For millions of years? Yes, for ages and ages. Well, that don't sound fun. Let's hope we can destroy Dark Gaia once and for all so you can just stay awake and hang around. Wait. Oh, it's, it's night time now. Time for more Werehog. I bet it's thanks to you. Mm -hmm. Even at night when I'm like this, I'm still myself, not like all the other people we've seen. You must have been protecting me this whole time. Mm -mm. I haven't done anything, Sonic. You're the reason you haven't changed at all. You're too strong to lose yourself. I'm the reason? Yeah. You never doubt yourself, no matter what. You never give in to the night, or the darkness inside your heart. I think it's because I knew that about you. That's why I wanted you to help me. It's been so fun getting to see the world. I've lived here since the planet began, but I didn't know a thing about it. That it's so pretty, or that food tastes so good, or that people are so nice. I'm so glad I got the chance to discover all that with you, and I'm so Aww. glad you helped me find my memory. Sonic. I will never, ever forget you. Thank you, Sonic. Goodbye, Man, friend. I really like Chip. Wait, goodbye. Hey. Whoa, what? <laughs> Where do you think you're off to all by yourself? What? But my memory is back now, and, well, from here on out, it's my responsibility. So, um, I mean, there's no reason for you to come along, so I should just... Do I need a reason to want to help out a friend? Thanks, Sonic. Yeah! <laughs> oh, I love this scene. That is a real feel-good scene. So, people have arrived during all that. Hello, Lit, and hello, Maddie. Hey, Sonic, we ought to report to the professor. Let's head to the lab. I'm definitely hoping that once this is over, Chip does not go back to sleep for another few million years. Again, though, I don't recall ever hearing of him outside of this game. Maybe I just don't pay enough, enough attention to the other Sonic games? Not sure. Maybe he is in the other games. By the way, I forget if I said this already, but I think it's kind of lame that Sonic's transformations is basically a bright flash and then he's in his other form. Would have been nice had it been kind of cool and dramatic like in the first time he transformed. I mean, it doesn't have to be as much a spectacle, but a little something would have been nice. By the way, I was trying so hard not to crack my voice. During that scene, I wanted to go like, oh, that sort of thing. But that would have been really annoying. Ah, 
Sonic, so good of you to come. Based on my analysis and data supplied by Tails, I have ascertained the location of Eggman Land. Oh, I I've heard about this place. Somebody mentioned that Eggman Land was going to be a thing in this game, so I've kind of been looking forward to it. Are you prepared for immediate departure? I'm good to go. Go now, Sonic, and stomp out this evil at its source. Understand Eggman's tastes. I like it. But get a good shot. <laughs> Surprise? Yes, of course you are. <laughs> if you have any complaints, come deliver them to me in person. If you can, that is. <laughs> Enjoying this way too much. Me too. Sonic! I can feel the last temple nearby. He must have built this place on top of it. Well, I guess we'll just have to tear it down. The final battle. There's no turning back now. Wait, really? Um, I'm not ready for this. We're going on a break. And when we come back? Uh, the final battle? Really? No. 